All right, guys, welcome back. This is Nick up here at Maple Motors at Hendersonville, Tennessee, and today we're going for a test drive in a 1954 3100 pickup truck. Should be pretty fun. I believe it was a 305 under the hood. It's got everything under there. I don't know if the AC works. We'll be trying everything out, though. Looks like disc brakes in the front, drum in the rear. That's an old patina look. This is the real patina. They got her lowered down on a nice set of wheels and tires. If you're new to this channel, go ahead, hit that subscribe button. I post stuff every single day. As you can see, we got a classic car lot up here. We take all kinds of different stuff in. If it's unique, if it's an American muscle, we'll be interested. So you can email us your rides if you're wanting to do some trading as well. We got finance options available, wheels, tires, parts, accessories. And we can ship these all over the country. Make sure our hood's down and secure. It's that time. We're going for a test drive, guys. Let's go down the road. Kind of look around this old interior in here before we take off. It's not nothing really special in here. Needs some work. Old patina. Headliner. You can go ahead and take the pole up in the top right corner if you think the horn works it does have tilt on the column we'll go ahead and start it up starts up nice and easy it's like a early early 90s model uh, fuel injection motor try our winch well i don't want to try the winch wipers there's no blade there that'd have been a bad idea let's see if i can pick it up It ain't even got enough pressure. I'm gonna assume it doesn't work. Yeah, it doesn't work. All right, let's go ahead and try the horn. No horn. Uh, our temp gauge is not coming up. Gas gauge is buried on E. Oil pressure's not hooked up. Showing 57,999 on the miles. Uh, there's no AC controls or anything in here. You got all the compressor and stuff. They just took the motor out of the old uh, 90 model truck. So, All right, let's take off. There's no seat belts in here either. I don't see any. I'll tell you what. It's a pretty cool truck, but it's going to need some stuff done to it. Get that long, tall shifter. steering's working pretty good. Well, brakes feel pretty good. Took off decently fast. Try to get around these people here. I don't have a rear view mirror at all. <laughs> uh, 
right. Yeah, he's got one of those Jeep trucks. Those things are fun. All right, I'm gonna pull in here. Be about twenty dollars worth of fuel, and we'll keep this rocking. We up here at the gas station. I just got done putting about twenty dollars worth of fuel in there, and no, the gas gauge doesn't work. But I didn't want to uh, run low, so I went ahead and threw it in there. Put it in right here on the side. Let's take off. All right, guys, gonna set y'all back up in the virtual driver's seat. Get y'all on my head again. I'm gonna try not to turn my head too much. <laughs> I just did the walk around out here. I went ahead and did that while I was over here, so. Working a little late this afternoon, trying to get all these cars caught up. Seems to run and drive pretty good. Other than it just being a little bumpy. this street right here kind of give you an idea right here that wasn't too bad I don't know why I'm using this turn signal I'm not sure if it works or not I don't hear any kind of indicator in here so I actually have to get out of the car and check to the lot now should have got all the information done for the day so about time to head on all right guys i appreciate you riding along with me if you have any other questions definitely visit maplemotors.com We've got close to 100 detailed pictures, financing information, wheels, tires, parts, and accessories. And I can ship this anywhere in the U.S. So definitely check that out. I want you to see all of our inventory up here as well. We sell classic American muscle cars. 
We've got tons and tons of videos here on YouTube. We got a walk around, a complete walk around every week of every new car that we pick up at the lot. So definitely check out the uh, walk around of this truck. It'll point out any kind of flaws that I could find, give you some undercarriage shots. I do appreciate y'all watching. Thanks again, guys. Oh, come on.